Hey everyone, this is Katarina here, and I am actually camping right now. I am in Manchester State Park in the state of Washington, and I'm on my way up to Canada today. And I am getting to go see family and friends and do all this really fun stuff. And I actually, uh, on Sunday, I actually have this really cool retreat scheduled for John and I to go up to in, in Bellingham. And then after that, we get to go to a friend's birthday party, and we get to go hang out in Seattle for a little while, and then we also are renting a tiny house in Olympia. That's a, something that John and I have always wanted to do, is uh, live in a tiny house. So it was a pretty full week ahead for me, and today I actually just really wanted to talk to you about freedom and what real freedom means to me and what freedom really is in my book at least because <laughs> really that's all I can talk about is from my experience for me freedom has a couple levels you know there's spiritual freedom there's financial freedom there is you know um, like mental freedom physical freedom, all of these things that are all kind of tie into one package, which freedom is. And all of these different layers make up how free we actually feel. You know, for me, being spiritually free means being able to believe and feel as I do and be able to talk about my experiences and my own personal relationship with, you know, God, source, whatever I want to call it and not feel restricted by any particular dogma or any particular belief system. Financially, I think freedom comes for me, at least, in a package of being able to travel on the road like I'm doing right now and being able to still earn an income and being able to do what I want to do with my life and not being stuck to a desk in a particular place, working for a particular person. So my other types of freedom, you know, physical freedom, being able to, you know, travel around and being able to go and move and do and be out in the world and not feeling restricted by physical inability to uh, be active or move, like in terms of health or job locations or all of these things that keep us trapped, really. Mosquitoes, hang on. <laughs> um, see, I'm exercising my physical freedom to not be stuck with mosquitoes. I think that being able to be free is really a lot about how we feel we can express in this world and what we allow ourselves to do. And when we allow ourselves to actually be and express ourselves to the fullest, we just find this natural free-flowing freedom that is inherent in who we are and what we do. You know, whether or not, if you're living a life that's not matched to you, you're gonna feel stuck, you're gonna feel imprisoned, and you're not going to feel fully fulfilled. And being able to be free means to be able to express and be who you are at all times to the most you have at that given time, you know, capacity. I posted something on Facebook yesterday that got my account blocked for a little while, you know, talking about women being able to be free in New York City, <laughs> having the choice to be bare-breasted or not, I think that, that was a little too over somebody's paradigm and it got me shut down for a little while. But I think that the direction that we're moving as a community, this Earth global community, is to be one that's more free-flowing and accepting of everybody's freedom you know, financially freedom, financial freedom, you know, emotional, spiritual freedom, the freedom to be expressive with our bodies, 
all of these things are crucial to freedom. And if we don't have them, then we feel like we're trapped, slaves. We feel stuck, depressed, refined, like just confined. And without it, we don't thrive the way that we're meant to. So that's what I'm doing here. You know, I'm being a pioneer and stepping out of all of these boxes so I can show others that, you know, it's possible to do that and to live your life and really enjoy it and to really feel that sense of fulfillment that you really want. And I hope that you're with me. If you're watching this video, you're probably feeling some of the same things that I'm feeling. You're probably, you know, walking the same path I am. So I encourage you to be free. I encourage you to, to live and dance and love and do all of these things that, you know, your heart really wants to do, but you don't let yourself sometimes. So with that, I will let you go with your day because I have to be out of the campsite and on the road. And I have a dinner plan to meet up with at 6 p.m. tonight, so I am off. But I really hope that you enjoy the rest of your day and go be free. Oh yes, and also, if you like this video, if you like my message, go join my group, Be You to the Fullest, and go share in there and be on the watch for more of my videos and my posts and just enjoy. All right, talk to you later.